It's the single largest crackdown against dissent in Hong Kong since its restrictive national security law came into force last year. Criminal charges have been brought against the leading lights of the pro-democracy movement, including legal scholar Benny Tai, who was fired from Hong Kong University last year for his role in the territory's protests, as well as former lawmakers and activists who remain determined to fight on. They're charged with conspiracy to commit subversion under the Beijing-imposed law which makes even peaceful dissent illegal. Last year, the activists participated in unofficial election primaries that would have selected which pro-democracy candidates could run for office. The vote drew 600,000 people in a city of 7.5 million. The long-term goal was to take over the territory's legislature democratically and force out the pro-Beijing chief executive Carrie Lam. The city was rocked by huge pro-democracy protests in 2019, at times violent, and included a siege at a local university that lasted 12 days. Beijing is hoping the new restrictions will bring the movement to a definitive end. The activists are set to appear in court on Monday.